This is going to be a series of individual videos on testing of many do-it-yourself alcohol stoves that I built out of small clear lid, clear lid containers. Cost anywhere from a dollar to two dollars each. I built a couple stainless steels around seven dollars each. This introduction part of the video will be included at the beginning of each stove video burn test. So skip ahead a little bit if you have already watched this portion of the video and want to get right to the burn testing. Each stove and video will be numbered and tested. Go to video number one if you want a basic description of the many stoves. I'll try to put all the specs in the description box of the video. Uh, what I'm going to test is the warm up time, boil time, burnout time, water temperature, and surrounding air temperature. I'll also include the alcohol capacity of each stove, the size of the stove, and the various materials used such as tin, aluminum, stainless steel. There will be a jet type, a wick type using carbon felt right here. Uh, and that will be to compare the different designs and materials. Each test will be done with the same aluminum pot. It has a 5 inch diameter bottom. I bought it at Walmart for a couple bucks. Um, well, I'll be using tap water. It's around 60 degrees plus or minus 5 degrees Two cups of water and there will be a couple tests that I'll use four and six cups of water Surrounding air temperature is in my garage. It's winter time in Iowa, but my garage is around 40 degrees So it's a little cool uh, My water temperature thermometer is about five degrees low so keep that in mind and all the specs that I'm doing here is is not exact it'll be approximately I have some extra materials to build other stoves so if you have any suggestions or want me to try something different please let me know and I'll do it let's get started with the testing all right this will be do-it-yourself stove, alcohol stove number 10, but I'm going to call this 10.5 test with four cups of water. Might be able to do six, but I'm going with four to make sure we get it to a boil. And we're going to use one and a half ounces of denatured alcohol instead of three quarters. Uh, if you want to see how stove number 10 is built and what it's made out of, go to video number 10. 10 do it yourself alcohol stove 10 the one previous to this let's light this baby up start our clock see what we get for warm up time should be about the same as 10 which was about a minute water temperature is 57 degrees air temperature is below 40 close to 40 degrees we got four cups of water one and a half ounce of denatured alcohol same stove as number 10 this is test 10.5 see if we can get these jets lit This stove is made out of stainless steel, so it'll last a long time. While we're waiting for the jet, I might as well, this, this is the interior wall of the alcohol stove, which is a moose can that I got at the dollar store. It's made out of aluminum. It's thin, thin aluminum, but it's a lot thicker than a can. A pop you know a pop can we're up to a minute 20 and it has the jets haven't started up yet it's because there's more alcohol in the stove now so it takes a little longer to heat up 
The alcohol temperature is around 40 degrees in the garage here. The jets are lighting up. Jets are lit, so we're gonna get ready to put this on. We'll let it warm up a bit more. We'll call the jets lit at one minute, 40 seconds. If you want a more detailed description, go to the description area on the video. Looks like it's warmed up good in around two minutes and we'll put the pot on. Now this is four cups of water we're trying to boil. I'll put more detailed specifications in the description box on all of these stoves. We're up to 2 minutes 38 seconds. We'll come back in when it reaches 5 minutes. Alright, we're at 5 minutes and we're at 80 eight degrees, 90 degrees water temperature. You can really hear the jets working. I don't know if you can hear it on video, but I can hear them. This is do-it-yourself stove number 10 with the smaller jet holes about 5 64th inch spaced half inch apart around the bottom of the lid. It's about an inch from the bottom of the pot, the jets close to an inch. Bottom of the pot's about five inch diameter. It's an aluminum pot from Walmart, a couple bucks. Cheap pot. We're at 100 degrees, six minutes. We'll come back in about eight minutes. All right, we're at eight minutes and we're 126 degree water temperature. I'll shut up, listen to it for a minute and then we'll shut her off and come back. Okay, 10 minutes and 151 water temperature degrees, four cups of water, one and a half ounce of denatured alcohol. Twelve minutes, 178 degrees water temperature and it's starting to sizzle just a little bit. Four cups of water. We'll shut her down till we get to about 190. Well, we're up to 183. really starting to sizzle. Maybe I'll leave it on. 12, uh, coming up to 13 minutes. Be interesting to see how long this goes before it burns out too with 1.5 ounces of alcohol. 13 minutes, 189 degrees, getting close to boil. Actually, no, we ain't. We need to get to 205 degrees. It's warming up good now. The jets aren't acting so sporadically. One ninety-four, six. 
Now we're getting close to boiling point. 13 minutes. Fourteen minutes, two oh one, it's about ready to boil. Fourteen minutes and seventeen seconds. Fourteen minutes, seventeen seconds to boil. Yep, it's boiling pretty good. Four cups of water. Now we'll see when it goes out. So this stove's pretty nice. It only weighs an ounce and a half, so you can backpack it in, take it with you camping, wherever, and you could boil four cups of water with an ounce and a half. I know I was boiling six cups of water with an ounce and a half when there was warmer temperatures. Like around 60 to 70 degrees air surrounding air temperatures. So I just put four cups because I wanted to get it to boil and obviously we got it to boil. 14 minutes, 17 seconds. Kind of curious when this is going to go out. Once it got close to boiling, those jets weren't as sporadic as they were earlier. So it's burning a little more efficient right now. It's not using as much alcohol to keep that boiling. This could go for a while. We're up to 17 minutes, 30 seconds. It's pretty good for an ounce and a half. I'm gonna shut her down for a minute. This is gonna I'll just edit the video. There she's dying down at 18 minutes. Still going, still going. It's done boiling. About 18 minutes, 10 seconds. 18 minutes, 10 seconds. There you go. We can boil four cups of water with stove number 10. This is test 10.5 with four cups. Thanks for watching everyone. I really appreciate it. If you have any suggestions, let me know. I got some extra stoves here. I can build whatever you want. Thanks for watching.